Congratulations on assembling your new tower garden. Now you're ready to add the water and nutrients so you can soon be growing your own healthy vegetables, fruits, and herbs. I'm here to walk you through it, so let's get started. Your tower garden will hold approximately 20 gallons when filled to within 3 inches of the top lid. Use a hose to fill the reservoir with cool water. Do not overfill the reservoir. You don't want to use softened water, heavily chlorinated water, or very hard water because it may damage your plants. Now we are going to mix the tower tonic that provides the nutrients to your tower garden. You're going to need to wear protective gloves for this, like rubber dishwashing gloves, because the base or acid liquids could irritate your skin. When you are first starting your tower garden, use half-strength tower tonic. You want to add 200 milliliters of tower tonic A and 200 milliliters of tower tonic B to the reservoir. Make sure you stir each tonic into the solution separately using a non-metal spoon. Do not use your hands to stir in the tonics as the solution may be slightly acidic or alkaline and can irritate the skin. The optimal pH is 5.5 to 6.5. If an adjustment is necessary, use 1 to 2 tablespoons of the pH buffering solution to either raise or lower the pH of the nutrient solution. If further adjustment is necessary, continue to add a small amount of the pH buffering solution and retest the pH level until the correct range is obtained. Once your pH level is within the desired range, plug in the pump and check to see that water is coming near the top of the tower garden. You want to set your flow rate so that the nutrient solution does not touch the shower cap lid, which may cause leaking. Your tower garden comes with an adjustable flow rate dial on the pump. Use this dial to control the flow rate. Turning the dial counterclockwise opens the flow rate to maximum, and turning the dial clockwise reduces the flow rate to minimum. If you have already added your tower tonic, please ensure that you are wearing protective gloves. Now you can put the lid on the shower cap. Your tower garden functions better if the watering is on a cycle rather than a continuous flow. That's why we included a timer in your tower garden growing system. We recommend 15 minutes on and 15 minutes off. To set the timer, follow the instructions found on the back of the timer. With your water and nutrients in place and your pump working properly, you're ready to place the access port lid on the reservoir lid. Congratulations! Your tower garden is now operational and ready to grow. I invite you to join me for a video on how to start your seeds for your tower garden.